Greetings and salutations, and welcome to another episode of Lord X's Trophy Hunt. On today's episode, I'm showing you how to get The Streak Ends, a gold trophy in WWE 13. And just like the last video I did, the first thing you want to do is go to your options and fix the in-game options. Here you can see I'm setting it to Legend difficulty, then backing out. And lovely load screens. Gotta love loading screens. Some of these are kind of crazy for how long it takes. Okay, and next you want to go into the balancing and lower all these sliders to the lowest settings. Very important. Very, very important if you don't want your enemy reversing everything on you. And then you want to go not to general, but to damage and set finisher damage to max. Again, very important for what we're going to do to make this very, very easy. Okay, once that's done, you go into Universe Mode, which you have to go in for this trophy. Now, and yes, it has to be at WrestleMania. Now, I kind of was a bit stupid when I was recording this because I was, because I was like, I'm going to get the Gold Standard Trophy as well. Winning all three major titles. Well, the unfortunate thing is, <laughs> I thought it was the ECW World Heavyweight title and the WWE title. Unfortunately, it's the ECW title, the WCW title, and the WWE title. Not the World Heavyweight Championship, which technically was the WCW Championship stupid game <laughs> okay then you want to go into the match here with the Undertaker edit freely because I was going to make it a title match to get the gold standard title fortunately you don't have to worry about this for the streak ends this is just me being stupid again <laughs> all right so once you have the match set up you go into here, and once again, very important, you set your finishers to infinite. And you give your opponent none. Turn entrances off if you don't want to be bothered with that. Listen to some great music there. And then going straight into the Hell in a Cell match. Roger versus The Undertaker. Yeah, not a very creative creative character, but hey. Twenty seven hundred oh So uh yeah. My little beat down on the Undertaker. I could have made this a bit short. I mean, hit a few of these pin that would have been it. But I had to mat make the match a bit exciting. So without spoiling anything, let's sit back and watch the match. Yeah, I decided it was Undertaker at WrestleMania. You just can't beat him down a few times. You gotta make the match exciting at least. And that's where I discovered you can't do the oh my god moment on that side of the cell. Yeah, have to do it over here. So you, if you didn't know how to escape the cell before, which you should if you're enjoying this game, that's how you do it. Get a finisher up and you do an oh my god moment over there. I meant to throw Tiger outside there, but hey. 
threw him over the steps instead. And if you're playing any Hell in the Cell matches like me, you know you gotta get outside of the cell and up on top of it. Only fun things can happen up there. I really like the design of that uh, WrestleMania. And that didn't work out too well, now did it? <laughs> it's like, hey, I'm supposed to crash him down through, not go down myself. So with that in mind, I had to get back up top again. And like I said before, you don't have to go with, through all of this in order to get the trophy. You only gotta whack him with the finisher a few times and then pin him. Easy as that. But I wanted to put a show on for you guys. Plus I wanted to do this. Uh, another thing I want to point out is I love the reactions now they give to the other character up on top there. As you can see where they reach up and actually grab the ropes. Yeah, we can't have Undertaker doing a comeback on us. I really wanted to go with the frog splash here. It's my creative character's other finisher, but as you just yeah, as you just saw, it didn't quite work out for me. I was gonna do it again, but he sits back up. So I was like, nope, screw this. It's time just to finish him. Boom! I'll admit, there's one thing that does annoy me about WWE 13, and that's the replays like this. They happen way too frequently for my liking. And there we go. And the trophy should pop up now at any given second. There we go. The streak ends. So there you go, guys. It may be a gold trophy. It may require you to play on legendary difficulty. But at the end of the day, it's very, very easy to get. So, there you go. Another trophy to add to your collection. Just like I just added it to mine. So guys, until next time, thank you for watching. Happy trophy hunting. And I'm Lord X. Bye! The music there, by the way, is Fling Out the Flag by Shannon Ganook.